On the 10th of September 1989, the plane carrying the then Secretary General of Swapo, Andimba Toivo Yatoivo, and other Swapo leaders touched down on the Namibian soil. Yatoivo had left the country in 1984 after being incarcerated on Robben Island in South Africa for 18 years. On his return home, he was received by Prime Minister Hage Genkob, who had arrived in the country earlier. Yatoivo, who turned 90 years old last month, is thrilled to be home for a quarter of a century. For me, mm -hmm. uh, it's, a, it's an important month. Mm -hmm. Because when I left for exile, I left in September. Mm -hmm. When I came back, mm -hmm. I also came back in September. The repatriation of Namibian exiles began in the second week of June 1989, under the auspices of the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees and the Council of Churches in Namibia, CCN. Bob Vedera Kandetu was the Associate General Secretary of CCN at the time. He says the CCN faced a lot of hostility from the colonial authorities in its preparation for the return of Namibian exiles to their motherland as it was viewed as a stage setter for a Swapo takeover of government. Recalling the events of that month, Kandetu says, the atmosphere was charged. That is, that is when people started realizing that Anaka, this thing that people are talking about, is coming. Uh, that is the time when youngsters in Swapo uh, started coining contextual relevant songs like, I want to see Semanawi, I want to mm -hmm. Semanawi, Ma. So it was playing against the background of Anaka. These people are returning. Nyoma is on his way. Founding President Sam Nyoma arrived two days later, and despite all the political contestation in the country at that time, the return of Namibian exiles was a practical realization of the long dream of people who were oppressed to live in a free and independent Namibia. For almost a quarter of a century now, Namibians are now in charge of their own destiny, and for many war veterans such as Yatoivo, it was a journey they will forever remember and be proud of. Donate Nishidudu, NBC News, Venduk.